Hey guys, what's going on? Jimmy Gavales, the kitchen cabinet guy. In this episode, we're gonna talk about the toe kick area of a cabinet and what can be done to embellish it a bit. The toe kick area is the part, the bottom part of the cabinetry, okay? It's called the toe kick area because it's the area for your toes. So when you're standing in front of a cabinet, your feet actually go beyond the face of the cabinet and they actually go underneath this area. So it's recessed back a bit to accept uh, the fact that someone is standing there. So a typical toe kick is made out of the same material as the cabinets. There's nothing wrong with that. It's beautiful, gives it a finished look, and it provides the space necessary for someone to stand in front of the cabinetry. We don't do much of this. We don't embellish toe kicks too much. In the 80s and 90s, we did a little more because traditional kitchens were super, super popular and heavy moldings were popular as well. We don't embellish toe kicks as much as we once did. However, there are options that you can use. For example, one option is to do a French leg. Um, it's kind of like a claw foot, uh, it's also called, I believe. Um, it adds a little bit of touch, very uh, traditional, uh, very uh, French country-ish, um, if you really want to get specific. So that is one option you have. Another option to consider is a tapered leg. Uh, this is much more popular today. Um, it's a simple leg. Uh, it uh, lends itself more transitional. Um, even we do it in some uh, industrial type, modern type uh, kitchens. Um, it's a good option, it's simple. Uh, again, we don't do much of it, uh, but we do um, offer it to our clients as an option to embellish the toe area just a little bit. Another option we offer our clients is a, I guess a furniture end base piece, you can call it. I'm not sure if there's a specific name for this type of toe embellishment. It gives it a, a framing type of feel. You do it on one side and the other side. You do it along a run of cabinets. You could do it just on one cabinet. And it gives it a, a, a nice finished detail, very furniture-like, very uh, lends itself more traditional, obviously, because it's furniture-like. So those are some of the options you can do to the toe kick. You could add valances. Valances is what's typically used on top of a window uh, to connect two uh, cabinets on either side of a window. It gives you a, uh, a bridge type feel. You can do that under cabinetry. You could add pieces of molding under cabinetry. I mean, you can get a little a little nutty with this stuff. There's a, I don't know, we sell about a thousand kitchens a year. Maybe a handful get toe kick embellishments that are really heavy by us. And it gets just as involved as doing a crown molding uh, detail. Uh, but to be honest, we don't do much of it, but I wanted to show you the different options or some of the more popular options that are available to you that it don't cost too much, that can add just a little bit uh, of something to your kitchen to make it a little different. Good luck with your project.